rescue me, rescue me, rescue me. Rescue me. We're back. We're down here at the shelter once again. And I have to confess, you guys out there, after all that fanfare I had last week about Rescue Me turning 12, hooray, 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 guess what? You didn't make a mistake. I made a mistake. Oh, no. We got a card from a fan, and the card said, Happy 13th anniversary. I checked back my dates, and sure enough, Rescue Me is 13. Is my face red, Randy? Uh, just a little bit, Terry. And that's why I'm not on the screen, ha ha. <laughs> so there you go. Rescue Me is 13. 13 wonderful years with these wonderful animals, thousands and thousands of animals found homes through Rescue Me. Now we're looking for a home for Mopsy here. Is he adorable? Oh, this is a cute little guy. I love this little guy. He is a senior, Randy. He's 10 years old. Doesn't but that's look nothing it. for a guy like Mopsy. Has a lot of energy. He is a very sweet little old guy. And he is a true, true lap dog. ID number 190-144 will connect you with Mopsy. Hey, Duke, look right into that camera. Let the folks see your gorgeous face. Here he is. This is Duke. He is a great walker and a hiker. He is very energetic. He loves to chase tennis balls. So if you are a guy who likes to play fetch with your dog, Duke's the one for you. He's just got a lot of energy, huh? He does. He's just a puppy. They say he plays like a puppy. And we love that about a dog who plays like a puppy. Duke's number is 179871. Hello, Augie. Here's your classic yellow lab looking dog. Kind of golden retrieverish with that bump on the head. What do you think? Handsome though, Randy, right? He is a good looking fellow and just a nice size. And he knows sit, so he's demonstrating it for you right now. He is a good dog for sit. He's great on a leash. Volunteers say he is very energetic and has a happy disposition. Isn't that a nice thing to have? That is. And you think if I told him to stay, he would stay, I think Augie. he's staying in his sit. That's oh, he's well-trained. Well okay, Augie, what's your ID number? 197-422 for Augie. Well, meet Tucker. Tucker is a guy that gets along with a lot of dogs here. He loves to play, especially with a gal named Jewel. He is a cuddler. And he likes to shake your hand. Oh, Greer, give him a cuddle there. <laughs> a yes, shake will do. there he is with a handshake. Okay, Tucker's ID number, 196283. Well, here's, here's Jewel, and she is a uh, good playmate to a lot of dogs. All the dogs love her. She's one of these dogs you throw in with all the other dogs, and they just love to play with her. She is a quick learner, likes some treats when she shows you what she knows, and she's a sweetheart. She is ID number 198529, and I think she's just the best size, just nice and medium, a pocket pit, we call her. 198529, Jewel. Randy, this is our volunteer's pick for May. Oh, it's well that, Randy. That, that means this is the best dog of all because the volunteers think she's the best dog of all. Yes, sir. We find out uh, on a monthly basis what dogs that are in the kennels do the volunteers really, really love and would like to take home if they could. And Brandy won the vote this go-round, so she is the volunteer's pick of May. That has some benefit, doesn't it? Yes, it does. First of all, she's a darn good dog. Second of all, you get half her adoption fee already paid for you. So if you come down here and fall in love with Brandy, you get half your adoption fee paid. She's calm, sweet, and amazing. If you meet her, you'll know what I'm talking about. She already knows sit and stay, so you can add more commands to that. And she can play Frisbee. Her ID number, 198354. Brandy. Tell me about this one, Terry. This is Hope, and she is another volunteer favorite. Everybody loves her. She Why do they love her? Oh, well, Randy, she is a sweetheart. Look at her. What you see is what you get. She just thinks she's a lap dog. She loves to cuddle, loves to give kisses, all of those things that dog lovers love. She's an excellent girl. She is ID number 198809, and because she is so great, we have paid half her adoption fee. All right, that's going to save some bucks, and you get a full price dog for half the price. Exactly. So I'd like you guys to come down here and meet <laughs> her, her, Hope, take her out in a yard, get to know her, and I bet you'll fall in love with her. That's Hope, ID number 198809. 
Oh, what a sweet little teeny tiny guy. What's his name? Well, Randy, his name is Gangsta, but this can be changed at a moment's notice. He's such a sweet boy. He is gentle. He is loving. He is sweet. He's a little older boy, but that kind of comes in handy. You know why? Why is that? Because we have a senior adoption rebate for you. I'll bet it's half the price. Well, it's not quite half the price. (laughs) It's $35 back into your pocket if you fall in love with Gangsta, who is a senior. We give a $35 adoption rebate. He is ID number 923115, and it looks like he's got a lot of get up and go. He wants to get (laughs) up and go, that's for sure. He's just showing you that he's very youthful. But he is no gangsta. He is no gangsta. He is a (laughs) senior. He gets a $35 adoption rebate, and his number is 923115. Well, this gal qualifies as being a puppy. She's just 10 months old. She is going to be named Ruby. She's too new to the shelter to call her anything yet, but we love the name Ruby for her, so that's what we're going to be calling her. She was found on the 16th of May in the South County at Los Barros Road in El Camino. In case you happen to know who this dog is, we'd like to get her back to you or whoever it is that lost this dog. You see there, she's got a canvas collar, Dale. Can you point to that canvas collar? No tag, no little Sharpie marker written on that tag, a phone number, and she would be back home somewhere around Los Barros Road. But she's with us. So if you like this dog, come down and see her. Her ID number is 199101. We're calling her Ruby. And she is puppy all over. Here's another newcomer to the shelter. We found this dog on the 15th of May in Morro Bay, right at Morro Rock. Can you imagine that? He could have been swimming out there in the ocean. Yes, he could have been. We're going to call him Simon if he stays with us, but we're hoping that his owner sees this show maybe and sees him and comes down and gets him. I don't know. Yet again, another canvas collar with no ID, no sh- no phone written It on takes the about collar. 30 seconds. Write your phone number on the collar with Sharpie markers. I that know, will get your I dog know. back to you. It's so easy. Anyway, back to this guy. We think he's about five years old, and his ID number is 199070. That'll connect you to him if you want to adopt him or if you want to redeem him if he's yours. Simon. This dog's name is Buddy Love, and we call him Buddy Love because he is a love. He is uh, one that likes to play with other dogs. We think he's a Labrador Retriever Dalmatian mix because he's got those spots, I suppose. Just a fine, nice dog. He's just about six years old, and his ID number is 197626. Buddy, love. We just never like to see these cropped ears on a dog. They look so cute with their regular ears. This this type of surgery, if I'll call it that, kind of makes the dog look a little fearsome. But a this bit dog intimidating is a, look, but yes, I not I an intimidating it. dog though, right? Not at all. This dog is just a love. Loves to cuddle. Loves to hug. Look at Dale's all over her. She just loves it. She's amazing and she's sweet. Her name is Athena. And her ID number is 198603. She is a little dog with a big personality. Come meet her. 198603. This is Sparky, Randy, and she has that underbite that you know I just fall for. Sparky, is she just renewable energy or what? (laughs) (laughs) Well, she's very energetic. She's six years old, but you wouldn't know it. She acts like a puppy. She loves the lap. This girl loves to sit on your lap. Just like she is there. Yeah. But she also likes to play chase with other dogs. She's really good with other dogs. She is uh, good on a leash and very, very sociable. Also, half her adoption fee has been paid. Oh, going to save some money. Come get Sparky. Yes, nothing wrong with that. Half her adoption fee, you'll be only paying half adoption fee when you adopt her. Her ID number is 198414. Sparky. Well, this dog get ra- gets rave reviews. Her name is Bandit. Not crazy about the name. She is no Bandit, but volunteers give her high marks in the personality department. I hear she with weighs it. a ton of personality. <laughs> she, yeah, she is loaded with personality. She's a load of personality. Look at her. She's darling. She is a total lap dog, and you can do anything you want with her. She loves hands on. Her ID number is 157812. That's Bandit. And she's a girl, she wants you to know. Bandita! 
Here's a wonderful dog. Her name is Callie, and she's just had her puppies, and she's just finished caring for her puppies, and her puppies all just got adopted. So now guess what, Randy? She needs to get a home for herself. Yes, she does. She's been doing such a good job as a mom, and now she needs to do a good job as your companion and best friend. She's a wonderful, wonderful dog. Her name is Callie, and her ID number is 198621, and I think if you meet her, you'll fall in love with her. She's a great size, nice and medium. She's even on the small side. She is even on the small side. She's looking for her puppies <coughs> right now. Where did they go? They just all got adopted. ID number 198621, Callie. I like this dog, Randy. He's got the nice long legs, nice face, good chest with that nice white streaking. He's Handsome. pretty pretty dog. He's a handsome boy and he's young. He's just about three years old. I think he'd make a great running companion. And the volunteers say he's a total love bug. So. Well, that's important. It's quite a package <laughs> you get here. Easy on the leash too. His ID number is 198988 and his name is Sammy. I like those ears. One up, one down. This is Booty, Randy. And uh, Booty is a boy. Booty is a boy, and he's a cute little guy. He's a cute little guy. He's just about two years old. He fetches a ball. Usually these little guys don't like to fetch at all. Well, it might take him a while to get there with those little legs, and but get he'll back. go get it. <laughs> he'll get the ball. Also, volunteers say he knows how to do a high five. Oh, good work, Booty. He likes other dogs, and he's very friendly. His ID number, 198804. Booty. We've just named this guy Wally, and we're trying to puzzle out his breed. We think flat coat retriever, but then his head tells us something about an Afghan hound. I don't know. What do you think? I think most dogs are a little confused and mixed up, but uh, he looks like a nice woolly dog. He is a woolly dog. He's woolly Wally to us. He is about eight years old, which qualifies him for the senior rebate. That That's going to save some money. That one money again, $35 back to you if you adopt Wally. He plays fetch, he's energetic, he's sweet, he's a very nice boy. Hey, Wally! 199023. We like this boy. This is a super cool dog. This is Jasmine, and uh, our volunteer thinks she's very regal, and I would have to agree with her. I think she is very regal. I could see the little crown on her head. She knows sit and shake. She loves the water, and she's learning a couple of few commands here while she's at the shelter. She likes to play with a lot of the other dogs that are here, which is great, because if you want to pair her up, perhaps, with a dog you already have at home, she could make a good other dog companion. Or she can be on her own. Jasmine is just that type of gal. Her ID number is 174274. That's Jasmine. Hey, Terry, you know where there's a doggy retirement home around? Well, I'd love to find one for Sydney here. Sydney really needs a place in the sun just to retire. Some kind of maybe life with a senior, just to be a companion. She'd do great with that. She enjoys her walks, though, Randy. Just a place to hang out, take a brief stroll down the street. No long runs or anything, just relaxing. Yeah, maybe strolling instead of walking, even. Yeah. But she's got a lot of spunk for a senior. She qualifies for the senior rebate. That gives you $35 back on your adoption fee if you adopt her. And she'll do a lot of napping, no doubt about that. Her ID number, 198778, Sydney. Here's another one of our timid gals, but she's come a long way since she first got here to the shelter. The volunteers have done a wonderful job with her. It she was looks, amazing. She looks really well behaved now. She's well behaved and she likes people. When she first came here, it was so sad to see her. So she was shaking. She wouldn't go to anybody. But now, look at her. She's not that anymore. Not that anymore. Her name is Roxy and she's very affectionate. Her ID number is 198474. Here's the second Sparky of the day. This Sparky is in foster with Sandy, and that's Sandy there with him. And she has great things to say about him. And the good thing about adopting a dog who's been in foster is that the foster mom can tell you all about the dog's day-to-day -day activity. Sparky is very social with other dogs. He loves to sleep on your lap, and he will follow you around the house. He also sleeps in his crate at night, which is great if you like that type of thing. And I'm especially when you are gone that you like to know that the dog is safe in a crate at home. Well, Sparky takes to a crate. You know what you didn't mention? What's that? 
Sparky's darn cute. Oh, well, I <laughs> figure the folks at home can see that right there for himself. His ID number is 197452. And if you're interested in Sparky, what you'll need to do is to call the shelter. The phone number is 781-4400 and ask for Sparky by number 197452. And the shelter will connect with Sandy so that you can meet Sparky. 197452 is the number to get connected with Sparky. From what I hear, this is the first of the German Shepherds you're going to be seeing. This gal, she's a female, about three years old, was found on the 16th of May at Hutton and Highway 166 near the Santa Maria Speedway. Hmm, how about hmm. that? Maybe she was out racing her car. Maybe she was. <laughs> She uh, is ID number 199105. If you recognize her, come and get her if she's yours. It would be good if you had something on that big canvas collar, but yet no phone number whatsoever, no tags, no nothing. Poor gal. If she doesn't get taken and redeemed, we're going to name her Shay. ID number 199105. That's a beautiful, beautiful dog. Yes, I told you we had another shepherd. This is also a female, about one and a half years old. We found this dog on the 16th of May. Uh, Wasn't it brought into the Yes, 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 it was. Kennel. This was a left-in-the-night kennel dog. So this dog was stray, brought in by a good Samaritan. So if you're missing this dog, come and get her. Her, ID number 199086. Otherwise, we're going to name her Lolita. ID number 199086. This is the sweetest dog. I was out with this dog today, and all she wanted to do was sit in my lap. She just loves to be in the lap. So if this is what you want, this is what you get with little Jenny here. She's cute as she can be. She's friendly. She's really, really nice. She loves people. And she really, really, really likes hot dogs, Randy. Hot dogs. Yes. I like hot dogs, but I'll bet she likes me <laughs> she more. She loves hot dogs. <laughs> anyway, Jenny's number is 198470. Sweet little Jenny. And here Sandy is with a second foster that she has. This is Stormy. And Sandy is just crazy about this dog. And, San and Stormy's got a lot to be crazy about. She is a great, great, great little dog. She's very social with other dogs. Though she's a little shy at first, but she takes to other dogs. So it wouldn't be a problem if you had other dogs. She's good with people once she gets to know them. She is also crate trained, which is really great if you want to have your dog at home while you're out and you want to be sure what's going on at home. Stormy takes very nicely to the crate. And Stormy's got great ears. Look at that. She does. She has those <laughs> winning ears. Really, really good ears. Her ID number is 167754. So if you want to connect with Sandy and meet Stormy, you need to have that ID number, 167754. Call the shelter at 781-4400, and they will connect you with Sandy and Stormy so you can get together and meet Stormy. Well, Dale over there is trying to feature the athleticism of this little dog, Puck. That's the name we're going to give him if he stays with us at the shelter. We found him on the 16th of May in Paso Robles on Walnut and Creston Road, so maybe you're missing him. He's very interested in his own look there. He's a very positive, can-do kind of dog. He's fun. He's energetic. He loves to run. He loves to play. He's everything a dog should be. His ID number is 199103, and if we get to keep him and adopt him out, we're naming him Puck. So, connect Puck with ID number 199103. Here's another newcomer to the shelter. We found this dog on the 16th of May. Actually, he was left in the night kennel, but he is a newcomer to the shelter. His ID number is 199085. If he doesn't get redeemed, we're going to call him Regis, and he'll be available for adoption. He's a really nice dog. He's one of those Labrador Retriever types, the type of dog everybody wants. And if you want him, find him at number 199085. Well, this little gal, Rini, came to the shelter so scared that it was painful to watch. She doesn't look scared now at all. I know. That is what the volunteers can do down here. They just take a dog and turn them right around from a scared dog to a very, very friendly dog. This one came out of her shell and now all she likes to do is to sit on your lap. And she's doing that. Yes. Her perfectly. name is Scarlet. 
She's a dream dog. Her ID number is 198469. Well, these are the most adorable Cocker Spaniels, and they love each other. These two came in together, Randy. They uh, don't look alike, but they, uh, <laughs> but they like to eat each other, apparently. Yes, they do. Now, the blonde one, that's Fred. And Fred is eight years old. That means he qualifies for the senior rebate. So if you adopt Fred, that's $35 off your adoption fee. Juno is female, the black and white one. She is six years old. They are delightful. I was out in the yard with them, and they want to sit on your lap, both together, mind you. And their fur is so soft and silky. You pet that dog, and you automatically feel very relaxed. And if you are a cocker lover out there, you're going to love these two dogs. They're so much fun. So, Fred, ID number 199132. He's the blonde one. And the black and white Juno, 199134. Adopt them together or adopt them apart. We don't care as long as they get good homes. Here is a newcomer to the shelter. We found this dog on the 16th of May in the South County on East Price Street. This dog is about two years old and male. ID number 199096. If he is not redeemed by his owner, we will be naming him Hank and he'll be available for adoption. Look at that face. ID number 199096, Hank. Well, this West Highland Terrier came in on the 19th of May as a stray. She was found in Pismo Beach. She was tied on a pink rope. Does this ring a bell with anybody out there? Poor thing. She's a doll. She's female. We think she's about eight years old. And her ID number is 199147. If you have lost her, you know who she is and know the people who lost her. That's the number that will get you connected with her, 199147. If she doesn't get redeemed, we're naming her Geneva, and she'll be available for adoption, 199147. Well, here's just an all-around nice dog. This is Shadow, and he is just about four years old, and he's great with other dogs. He's in our Train to Adopt program, which what we're trying to do is to have some dogs uh, get some training before they get adopted and it makes them easier to adopt. He had a little trouble walking on a leash and so the volunteers are trying to train him to do that a whole lot better, which will make that better for you. His name is Shadow and his ID number is 927501. Okay, here we have Petal. She is a doll. Check out those ears, Randy. That's Yoda ears. Yoda ears. She <laughs> could just fly away if she chooses to. But she doesn't want to. Once she settles into the lap, she wants to stay put and cuddle. That's her number one thing to do is cuddle. She loves other little dogs. She plays all the time in the play yards with the other little dogs. And most of all, she loves her person. She gets a lap. That's what she loves most of all. Her ID number is 199051. Petal. Well, this is a newcomer to the shelter. We found this dog on the 16th of May in the South County on East Price Street. He is a tail wagger. I don't see how anyone isn't missing him. I'd be missing him if he were mine. He is male, just about two years old, and his ID number is 199097. If his owner doesn't come in to redeem him, we are going to call him Gorgeous George, and he'll be available for you to adopt. So if you want to come down and meet him, please do. Gorgeous George, his number... 199097. And another newcomer to the shelter. We found this dog on the 15th of May in Paso Robles on Vine and 30th Street. This dog is female. We think she's about a year and a half old. ID number 199076. If she does not get redeemed, we are calling her Judy, and you can come down here and meet her and hopefully adopt her. She's really a doll. Volunteers love her. She's very, very street sweet. ID number 199076, Judy. Well, here's a newcomer to the shelter. This is a male found in Cambria. ID number 135917. If this dog doesn't get redeemed, we're going to name him Lewis and he will be available for adoption. Volunteers are crazy about him. They all say he's very, very sweet. If you've lost this dog, connect to the shelter and ask for ID number 135917. Otherwise, come on down and meet him. And so we go with the cats, and we're starting out with Beyonce. Isn't she a beauty? I love her markings. She is a tortoise shell, and she's just about four years old. She is a doll. The volunteers call her a love bug. 
Her ID number, 198987. And here she is coming out to say hi herself. It's Beyonce, 198987. A pretty, pretty girl. Next up, we've got Albert. He is an all-gray cat. I know people out there love all-gray cats, and he's got those very, very light green eyes. Here he is showing them off for you. Albert is about four years old. He is ID number 198224. Albert. This is Black Pearl. That's a really great name for her. She is just about two years old. She has those beautiful amber eyes, very sleek back black fur, gorgeous, gorgeous cat. Her ID number is 198931. That's Black Pearl. Here we have two cats, Princess and Peanut. They are both 14 years old. That makes them seniors and eligible for the senior rebate. $35 back when you adopt one or both of these cats. Princess, 199017, and Peanut, 199016. Here is Flower. Flower is just about two years old, and she is a long-haired black and white tuxedo cat. She is ID number 198912, Flower. Say hi to Rufus. Rufus is a long-haired black cat. He qualifies for the black cat re rebate. That's right. Any cat you adopt from us who is black, $25 off the adoption fee. Rufus is just about two years old, and his ID number is 198959. Well, a lot of people are asking, do you have an all-white cat? Well, yes, we do. It is Sparkles. She is all white with those beautiful blue eyes. She is ID number 199040, Sparkles. Well, if you like the big tabbies like I do, you're going to love Garfield because he's a big orange tabby. Very handsome boy, and he's just about a year old. His ID number is 199057, Garfield. Next up, we have Enver. M Ember, a beautiful, beautiful black cat. She is eligible for the black cat rebate. That's right, $25 back to you if you adopt Ember. She is just about two years old, and her ID number, 198618, Ember. Here's a newcomer to the shelter. We found this cat on the 15th of May in the North County, Neal Springs and River Road in Templeton. This cat is female. We think she's about a year old and her ID number is 199078. Are you missing her? Do you know this cat? 199078. Here's another newcomer to the shelter. This cat we found on the 17th of May in San Luis at Ocean Currents, South Higuera and Santa Margarita Street. This cat is male and we think about four years old. ID number 199121. Are you missing him? Do you know this cat? ID number 199121. Here's another one of those nice big tabbies. This looks like a Maine Coon type cat. This cat is male and we're calling him Prince. He's just about two years old and he is a handsome, handsome boy. His ID number, 199054, Prince. Here's a newcomer to the shelter. We found this cat in the North County, Neal Springs Road in Templeton. This cat was found on the 15th of May, ID number 199080. Behind the tabby is a black cat, also found in the exact same location, ID number 199079, found also on the 15th of May. Do you recognize these cats? 